what is going on YouTube it's your boy Billy Kibaki and in today's video I'll show you how to play GameCube games on your jailbroken PS4 5.05 using Linux OS. I've made videos before how to install Linux, how to play PS1 games, PSP games, Wii games, Nintendo 64 games. If you guys want to check those videos out the link is in the description. Also guys keep in mind that not all of these games will work 100% alright so make sure that you guys keep that in mind. Okay so let's go ahead and get started. So right here I have my USB stick and make sure that your USB stick is formatted to XFAT because XFAT will allow large transfer files over on the USB stick or portable hard drive okay. so. Right here I have my folder GC games for GameCube games and inside it I have my GameCube game right there Super Smash Bro. Okay so once you have your games on your USB stick or your portable hard drive let's head over to the PS4 now. Okay guys so now that we're on the PS4 you should have everything connected to your PS4 your USB mouse, your Linux hard drive, your PS4 controller connected with the USB cable. Alright, so once you have all of that, let's head over to the internet browser. And you should know how to load up Linux by now because we have covered that throughout the other four videos. All those video links will be in the description. So go ahead and run Linux. When you get this message, just press yes. Okay guys, so as you can see Linux loads up on the PS4, so we can use the mouse that we have connected to the PS4, go up to the icon right here, the menu icon, click it, and as you can see we don't have a full menu, and to fix this all you have to do is go to JWM config, click on refresh menu, Now click it again and there you go. We now have a full menu. Alright, so let's go to file manager. Go to your USB stick that you have the games on. So this is mine right here. So I'm just going to click it. And as you can see, here is the GC game folder. Right click, copy, then go to home folder, ROMs. Now go ahead and paste your game folder right here. Right click and then click paste. Okay, so once the game folder is copying over, we can go ahead and close this. Then go back to the menu icon right here. Go down to games. Go to dolphin emulator. Okay, so once the emulator pop, pops up, you can go to controller. Okay, so up here it says GameCube controllers. So up here you can go ahead and, and config any one of these you want. As you can see, number one says standard controller. So we can click on configure. And you can go ahead and remap the controller in any way you desire. Okay, so I'm not going to mess with anything. Also, make sure that your, your controller is selected right here. And make sure that your controller is connected with the USB cable. All right, so as I said, you can you can config this how you like. Okay, so I'm just going to press close. Close this. Now go to open. Go to ROMs. Then select your game folder, your GameCube folder. And then go ahead, select the game and press open. And there you go, guys. It is working on our PS4. So we can use the controller and switch to whatever we want. So that's it guys, simple as that. If the video was helpful, please leave a like, also share the video around, and also you guys can subscribe for more videos to come. Thank you for watching guys and I'll see you in my next video.